Hi there, my name's Kenny, and I'm one of the people that's working on Little Big Planet. I'm an audio designer by trade, so I'm not normally known for my visual prowess, but I'm going to talk you through a level I made earlier on the PlayStation 3, which we can then play through later. To start off, I built some mountains to suit the rustic desert background which I've chosen. And what I'm doing here is just stamping these wooden blocks down to make the shapes that I want. Then taking some cardboard cactuses which I made earlier, I'm using some glue to stick them onto the platforms to make things look pretty. Okay, so here I'm constructing a frame to attach some piñata which I built earlier, and I'm just measuring the frame against the piñata to get the height of the frame correct, and then simply copying and pasting that first piece of frame to quickly create a more complex structure. This next section is going to be my little villa in the sun, and it's also built using simple shapes, the cutout tool, a little glue, and some stickers to give it a bit of personality. Nearly done here, I'm just going to put in a little challenge for players. Make sure you look out for that during the playthrough. Now this sombrero hat, which you can see here, is an object that I won whilst playing through one of the many levels that ship with the game. Similarly, materials such as this nasty fiery substance, the stickers and decorations, character customizations, and even this music track are all collectible items which can be won and then used in your own levels and creations. We're still quite a way off from finishing the game, we've got a lot of work to do, but in the meantime, I hope you've enjoyed this insight into using some of the basic construction tools in Little Big Planet. Now, let's play!